with this video, we are going to learn how to download and install GIMP into your computer. Alright, so as usual, I'm going to start with my Google Chrome. So in the search bar, I'm going to type GIMP Photo Editor Download. So here they are suggesting me the word, so I can click on it and open it. Alright, now from these few websites, I am going to select the second one. That means GNU Image Manipulation Program. So this will be the original website we should use when downloading GIMP. So on my screen, you can see a red button. Here they will display you the current version of GIMP. Okay, so first let's click on this red button. Now you can scroll a bit down. And from here, I'm going to directly download GIMP into my computer. So I'm going to click on my orange button, Download GIMP directly. As you can see, on the bottom of my screen, automatically the downloading process started. Okay, so it will take a few seconds, right? So once after the downloading process finishes, you can simply click on this file and open it. Alright, so I'll minimize my main window. Okay, so here they are asking me to select my installation mode. Okay, so if you are the only one who is using the computer, no issue, you can simply click install for me. So if you are using any other user accounts, you can give the first option, right? I'm going to use the first one. Alright, so now I have selected the language as English. Then you can simply give OK. Alright, now let's click the install button. This will take a few seconds. Okay, so my installation process has been finished. Now you can simply click on this button finish. Right, now we are going to open our GIMP app. There are two methods to do this. First you can click the start button. And on the top, they will display you the GIMP app. As the second option, you can go to your search bar and type GIMP. So like this also, you can open the GIMP app. Okay, so I think the downloading and the installation part is very clear for you. So next week, we are going to continue the next episodes of our videos. So stay tuned. So, see you with the next video soon. Thank you very much.